subscribe to everest cooking method and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you can see my videos continuously hello friends welcome to everest cooking method today we are going to see you know two type of snack recipe it's a sweet and snack recipe purely a krishna jayanti special it's a coconut milk murku and and also very very easy recipe it's a poha laddu it's a very easy recipe and also everyone can eat this recipe okay friends without further delay quickly let's get start the recipe for this murukku recipe i have taken 1.4 cup of udar dal roasted it well and take it aside i have used half shell of coconut milk dilute with small amount of water it's nearly 300 ml make a fine powder of the udar dal and sieve this without any lumps the next step is i have taken 1 cup of rice flour I have used back the rice flour only. Mix it well. To this, I am adding a two tablespoon of room temperature butter. It's a unsalted butter, and also a small amount of asafoetida. Put some salt and also sesame seeds. Now add the coconut milk slow by, and give it a mix. Add also a little amount of water, and make a murukku batter. This is a fine structure of the muruk batter. It should not be stick into the pan. Grease some amount of oil in this press and slowly make the muruk. Friends, you can make it into any shape. Use coconut oil to get a wonderful flavor. Keep the flame in only medium. Here we go a wonderful coconut milk murke is ready it's a best evening tank snack and also a festival recipe the next sweet recipe is poha laddu which means aval laddu it's a very healthy snack we are going to use 1 cup of poha i've used red poha and also equal amount of jaggery and also half cup of grated coconut This is a very simple and easy recipe. Let's get start the recipe. Dry roast the poha for about 3 to 4 minutes. It should be in a crunchy consistency. Keep it aside. Fry some cashews in ghee and also some dry grapes. In the same pan add 1 cup of jaggery syrup. Let them boil for about 5 to 6 minutes. We should make the coarse powder of the poha. It should be in a coarse consistency only. After five minutes, the jaggery will get the one string consistency. At that stage, add the pohas. Mix it well for about two to three minutes, and also add the grated coconut. At this stage, we have to add all the dry fruits. Switch off the flame. This is a perfect consistency of the ladu. For flavor, I have added the elaichi powder. Make a fine ball. That's it. Our poha ladu is ready. Let's enjoy this too snack and sweet for this Krishna Jayanti. And don't forget to press the bell icon for more cooking videos. Okay, friends, I'll catch another interesting video. Until then, take care. Bye.